Uh, Boyfriend is his new single, highly anticipated track. It's available now on iTunes. Came out at midnight last night or this morning. Midnight. Midnight. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. On the West Coast. Uh, tell me about picking Boyfriend as as your first single. It was uh, it was really hard choice. I mean, we had so many songs. And I mean, so many up tempos that we could have released and. You know, I thought we should slow it down a little bit. I feel like every single that's dropping is, is like this. You know right, I mean? So, so right. You, can, you can only take so much of that. So I wanted to do something a little different, slow it down. And, and uh, it's just uh, something something a little bit more mature, but it's it's also something that I'm, I'm re- I think I'm ready for. Yeah, there was so much talk about what you were going to do next. Mm-hmm. I mean, everybody in the music business, everybody in the world had an opinion about it. Mm-hmm. Did you listen to, to all that? Did you did you shut the door and say, you know what, I'm not going to hear any. I'm just going to focus on what's inside of me. There's so many people that yeah that are going to give me opinions and tell me how I should, um, how my career should go. But you know, I'm, I'm the only one who can ultimately make those decisions because like I'm going to have to live with my career for the rest of my life. So I have to make those decisions where where I want my career to, to go. So I thought this was the perfect single. So. That was why it was my my single. Right, Not so, because anyone else. Thought. So some of the lyrics, I'm going to play it here in just a second. I'm psyched to play it on the radio. This is a massive monster hit. Thank you. Uh, we are going to jam it in a second. You're going to hear a lot of this on the radio. But uh, some of the lyrics are, if I was your boyfriend, I'd never let you go. I can take you places you ain't never been before. Yeah. yeah. Befo. Before now, fun. are you, I knew it was <laughs> Befo, but I couldn't, I couldn't actually say <laughs> that. I'm glad you did it. So now, are you, is this first person or are you playing the role of every guy? Um, I'm just, I'm just, uh, basically, it's just metaphor. I mean, it's basically just for my f- fans. I right. Mean, that's it's it's a, not, it's not you saying, here's the kind of boyfriend I am. This is, this, this is, is the type of boyfriend I think that people should be should in general. Be. Yeah. This is what you should uh, this aspire is, this to This is what be. you should say to your girl. Okay. Listen to it right now. Justin Bieber, boyfriend. It's got a crawl to it, man. Yeah, it's man. got a smooth, <laughs> poised you. crawl to that. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, what's it like to hear it on the radio? It's great, man. For the first time, that's the first time I've heard it, so that's... It feels good. It's not, by the way, it's number one on iTunes. It's number one in like I, I think sixteen countries on <laughs> iTunes. We got some fans outside the studio. Manny on the streets is hey, Manny in the courtyard right say now. Say hi to Justin and Ryan, <laughs> Ellen. So, I, I got a couple questions, man. Yeah, what they think? Uh, what did you guys think about the new single? I loved it. You loved it. You had a question, right, for Justin? Yes. When is your next tour coming on? Good question. My next tour. Great question. Um, so after I re- after I finish my album and my album comes out, then I'm gonna. Uh, rehearse for my tour and then I'm going to go on tour so probably right like this summer this oh. summer and end of summer yeah, yeah. End of summer end of, end of end summer. summer so good news there yeah. you get some tickets right hopefully yes. yeah. yeah yeah and you, what's your question for Justin um do you ever get tired <laughs> uh. he doesn't no, look no I'm actually a robot I actually <laughs> no I'm just kidding no I definitely get tired uh but I'm good I actually went to bed pretty early last night because I knew I had an early date so I'm not tired he's got, today. He's got good work ethic. Yes. And one more question from Alex here. What's your question? Hi, Justin. I know you have your friend Alfredo Flores following you around yes. uh, making video. Can we expect another Never Say Never? Never Ever Say Never, maybe? Never, <laughs> never Ever Say Never? Yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, uh, you know, my fans all loved my uh, my first one, so uh, may- maybe m- Never Say Never Ever. That's, gonna, that's, what <laughs> that's, gonna be that's not not true. Yeah, it's not. All right, Manny, thank you very much. All right, thank man. you guys for thank being you. here. Oh, I have another question. Yes. What about another fragrance? Now the fragrance, yes, we're. What's we're the current doing fragrance? A, uh, it's someday. It's someday. someday, but um, we're doing another one. It's just a branch off of that, and another it's day. A d- it's a new scent. I don't know. Another day, another scent. Yes. Yes. Uh, all right, let's talk about your album for a second. It's okay. called Believe. Yes. And it's scheduled to come out Juneish. Yes. Okay. Can you give us just, just tell us a little bit about it? How's it? I know it's it's said to be edgier. It's That's so the word. no. I mean, it's just it's like um, a lot. Of, it's kind of classic, I feel, because the songs I feel won't get old. It's just the music is very fresh, but it's also it's also I'm taking a lot from from old school music. Uh-huh. Uh, like a lot of Michael Jackson is inspired in this album. Um, a lot of like old R and B, a lot of old pop. You know, just just stuff that that I feel I can bring into it, but also make fresh and new. So. It's it's pretty special. Did you work with Will I Am on any of it? I worked with Will I Am, yeah, a little bit as well. So, so months ago, this is maybe six, mm-hmm. eight months yeah. ago, he was here and uh, we were talking about you. Here's what he said. No, I want to get Justin Bieber into writing his own music and producing his own songs. And how's it going? He's gonna get 
hurt, where he's going to go through a relationship problem. Yeah. It's probably going to get, right, because we all did as teenagers. Mm -hmm. So the kind of artist that Justin Bieber can be is the kind of person that goes through stuff yeah. and able to think about it from and doesn't doesn't have to wait for anyone. I see. I don't know if you got hurt, but I feel like when when you're when you're doing boyfriend there that track. Yeah. I mean, I feel like you own that. That is you. That's who you are. Yeah. You know. That was me. That was me. That was me all the way. I, I wrote the whole thing, like the whole verses. Yeah. And uh, so it, it is just a representation representation of me. So that's what's. Special. There are fewer and fewer that question your talent. And yeah. after this record, I don't think anybody's going to question it. So congratulations. So We're going to come back with Justin Bieber right here. Justin Bieber is here celebrating his uh, almost worldwide number one with. Thank boyfriend you, thank you and uh people watching through the window uh as a matter of fact his manager Ryan scooter and Artie, can i help you is in the <laughs> is in the phone room answering phone calls and has been taking requests and getting feedback i think on the we, record we all morning already, long i uh, gave away the wango tickets but um He's if you show scooter. up with, with <laughs> ryan for breakfast scooter. he might give you some scooter put him <laughs> on hold for know. one sec he doesn't know who's yeah, put just hit the whole button. Okay. How, okay. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear hey, you. Hey, buddy. How are you? I'm good, man. How are good. you? Good. So how, how's it going on the phones? We're going really well. Everyone's really excited about Justin's record, but they're more excited to uh, find out where you're having breakfast tomorrow with cousin Artie to see if they can get <laughs> Twango Tango tickets. Breakfast with Ryan doesn't have the same ring as breakfast with Bieber this yeah. morning, which we're doing. Uh, very exciting day. You see uh, number one in like 16 countries on iTunes already. Mm -hmm. That's great. What can you tell us about the album? I asked Justin. Uh, okay, I got a good story for okay. the fans about the album. He, right. um, he turned 18 on March 1st. Yes, I heard. And we found out the exact time he turned 18, which is, I think, 12.56 a.m. Right. Mm -hmm. um, so we, we realized it was 9.56 here. So when he, it was 9.56, we said, Justin, you are exactly 18 years old now. He was in the booth recording a song he wrote about the fans, which is the title track of the album, Believe. And he wouldn't get out. He goes, I want to finish. So we all kind of looked at each other and said, wow, he's really committed and focused. So the album's really amazing. It's uh, everyone we played it for. We had Ashton Kutcher come over the other day because this whole punk thing um, and talk with Justin and hear the album. And, and he was shocked. And, uh, you know, I'm a 30 year old man and all my buddies who heard it are really, really <laughs> excited. So uh, it's uh, it, it's it's good. And I also apologize for all the people that now think you have a cousin, Artie, who yeah, can call you. Don't, don't worry. It's all right. <laughs> Well, I'm glad you guys are here to celebrate. Uh, by the way, speaking of turning 18, remember I told you I got you that uh, when you were 18, you can get a membership to Costco? That's, no. That's the Costco is. membership. You really got me a Costco I membership? You. Yeah, you got to You know go what I just that. got, too? I just got, like, uh, uh, I just got a year free. Pink berry. Um, no. A Yogurt year land. free uh, Chipotle. Oh. <gasps> Come on. Look, it's uh, got your name. It says Justin Bieber's custom-made, handcrafted, responsibly raised Sustainable Crown Burrito Card. After that plug, you're going to get 10 years <laughs> worth of, of big, beefy burritos. Congrats. Have you um, used it yet? Have, have you used it yet? I haven't used no. it yet. All right. No. Well, you can start today. Yeah. So you saw Hunger Games over the weekend. I did. I, I went. You think? I went at 1245, and I fell asleep because I was, just, it was so late. It was so late, yeah. and I worked all day, and, and it was, I thought it was cool to go to a 1245 premiere, but it was two-hour movie. and Two hours and 22 two, minutes. Yeah. Right? Yeah, and, yeah, and so it was like, how late when... It was Crazy, late. Yeah. It was middle uh, of the night, but it did uh, tremendously well over the weekend. Do you yeah. see yourself, not to compare it, but do you see yourself wanting to play roles in, in film scripted roles? Uh, yeah, uh, for sure. We're, we're working on scripts right now. Um, Mark Wahlberg uh, and I are working on a script right now. It's not fully done yet, but we're going to be doing a movie together. So. I know so that cool. Selena is away doing Spring Breaker. Is yeah. that the movie she's doing? Yeah. How's that going? No, uh, right now she's... Or is she done with she's that? No, no, she's, she's doing that right, right now. She's killing it. She's having so much fun. It's with James Franco and a couple other people, so she's really excited. Now, do you read her scripts? I uh, I mean, she gives it to me to read. I think you want to read. As the, yeah. as, as the guy in her yeah. life, you want to yeah. know what she's up to, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, if James I, Franco's in a movie with Selena, you want to read that. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I, I need to <laughs> figure out what's going on. Is, is this like... I have to throw down. Yeah, no. <laughs> but it's it's cool. She's playing like... Uh, she, it's kind of pretty... It's a pretty wild movie, um, I mean, especially for her. So she's uh, she's really excited to take on the challenge. And she's um, doing... Basically, she's... Uh, she... She's going out of her element because she's she's done a lot of like um like I mean her last movies and her you know her Disney show yeah, 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 is yeah. kind of younger but this is this is older and it's, she's really excited about it. And what are you doing to to fill time while she's away? Um I'm working, man. I just work all day. That's kind of keeps me occupied. Well, it's going well. Boyfriend is a song we just premiered here on 102.7 Kiss FM. It's out today. And this you worked with Posner on it. Yes. And so who's the team on this one? 
So um, Mike's this was a, he, Posner. He's a great songwriter. Yes, and Mason, who's uh, the producer, and they they killed it. We we just went in and we just made it, and and yeah, they helped out a lot. Brother, I'm proud of you, man. Thank Thanks you, for man. coming Thank in. Thank you so much, Justin Bieber. Good Yay. to see you. Thanks, Scooter. <laughs>